Have you ever noticed that everywhere you turn, people are talking about the easiest ways to make money online? And there's one method that keeps coming up over and over, building a faceless YouTube channel. They promise it's a game changer, the kind of business model that can bring in money around the clock. But here's the catch. While they're happy to tell you it's the best thing ever, they don't actually show you how to do it. Most of the time, it ends with a push to buy a pricey course, leaving you with more questions than answers. I know how frustrating that can be, and this time, I'm sharing everything with you. In this video, you're getting a straightforward, step-by-step -step guide on how to build your very own YouTube automation channel from scratch. We'll cover everything from picking the right niche, setting up the channel, creating videos, designing designing thumbnails, and finally, turning views into income. Let's get started. When it comes to creating a successful YouTube channel, choosing the right niche is everything. If you select a niche that doesn't resonate with people, it's going to be an uphill battle to get those views, no matter how great your videos are or how well you follow the steps in this guide. But finding a killer niche isn't just about picking something popular. It's about choosing a topic that YouTube is actively promoting to new audiences. So how do you find these high potential niches? Here's a simple trick. First up, explore trending topics on YouTube itself. Start with incognito mode. This gives you a clean slate so you can see what's popular without any influence from your browsing history. Once there, scroll through the homepage and look for videos from smaller channels that are getting big views. For example, if you see a channel with only 45,000 subscribers but only 8 videos, and some of those videos are hitting close to a million views, that's a big hint. YouTube is likely pushing that content because it's resonating with a wide audience. Check out the trending section and popular creators. Another great way to find viral niches is by using tools like Google Trends and vidIQ. These tools help you spot topics that are gaining popularity fast. To get started with vidIQ, just head over and link your YouTube channel. Don't worry, it's 100% safe to connect. Once you're linked up, go to the Outliers section. This is where you'll find all the trending and rising topics within your niche. Here's how I find a viral niche. First, I go to YouTube's trending section and look for videos with lots of views from smaller channels. Once I spot a good video, I search for that niche in the YouTube search bar and look for two things. Number one, low competition. Not too many big channels in that niche. Number two, consistent views. All videos in the niche get steady views. It takes a bit of time, but it's worth it. I found a channel that caught my attention. It has 53.7 thousand subscribers and already over 2 million views and it just started 9 months ago. They're posting consistently and getting thousands of views on each video. One even hit a million. Now, there's another channel doing something similar but on a bigger scale with 1.93 million subscribers and over 146 million views. They've been pulling in millions of views for years which tells me this is an evergreen niche. What's interesting is that both channels are using AI-generated visuals and voices. They're making around $5,000 to $6,000 a month from this content. This shows that with the right approach, this niche has real potential for consistent growth. We're using ChatGPT to make script writing fast and easy. Here's how. Head over to ChatGPT and simply paste the prompt I've given in the description. Now, in seconds, ChatGPT will generate a full polished script for our video. All right, now that our script is ready, let's move on to the next step. If you have a good studio quality voice, you can definitely use it for your videos. But let's be real, not everyone feels comfortable with voiceovers. That's where AI-generated voices come in. I recommend using Eleven Labs for voiceovers. They offer some of the most realistic sounding voices, plus a few features that really help your videos stand out. To get started, head over to Eleven Labs and sign up for a free account. Once you're in, click on Go to App. Next, copy the script you created with ChatGPT 
GPT and paste it into 11 labs. Now choose a voice. Click on the voice option, go to the voice library and pick the best one to match your script. I suggest selecting a middle-aged narration or storytelling voice for a natural sound. Once you've picked a voice, click Add to Voice Lab and it'll save to your library. Go back to the speech section, select your chosen voice and click Generate. Once satisfied with generated voice, click download. Just repeat this process for each part of your script. If your video has multiple character, consider using different voices for each. It'll add variety and keep viewers engaged. With the free plan, you get 10,000 credits, which should cover a couple of videos. But if you're serious about automation, the pro plan is affordable at $20 for 100,000 credits per month. Perfect for creating multiple videos regularly. Take a quick look at the competitor's video, and then at a snippet of the one we're creating. Once upon a time, there lived a young boy named Koji. Koji was always curious about the world around him. Once upon a time, in a small village hidden by towering trees, there lived a young boy named Hiro. You'll notice that we're aiming for a similar style with AI-generated visuals, but our goal is to stand out with a unique touch. You can use tools like Midjourney, but I recommend starting with Leonardo.ai. It's popular, offers free credits, and is great for creating unique visuals. Now we need text prompts for generating images. While you could write these prompts yourself, using AI will make this process faster and improve quality. Since ChatGPT created the script, it's already familiar with the visuals that suit our video perfectly. Just head back to ChatGPT and paste in the image generation prompt. You'll get all the prompts you need to generate images for each scene. Here's a pro tip. Try this prompt. Need image prompts for this line by line? Then paste a scene. ChatGPT will break it down and create highly specific visual prompts, ensuring each image aligns with our video seamlessly. Now head over to Leonardo AI using the link provided in the description. Once you're there, click on Go to App and then choose Image Creation. To save on tokens and keep the process efficient, set the generation mode to fast. Next, navigate to the preset section to pick a style. For this style of video, anime works well, adding a vibrant, dynamic look to the visuals. Then, set the image dimensions to 16 is to 9. This will ensure the images are the right size for video editing. Set the number of images to 4. Now grab your first prompt and paste it into the generator, then hit generate. After a few moments, your AI generated image will be ready. To make your video stand out, let's add some motion to these images. Start by hovering over the image you want to animate. Click on Generate Motion Video. Now you'll see an option to adjust motion strength. Set this between 5 and 8 for a subtle yet impactful movement effect. This will give your images a cinematic feel. Once you've selected the motion strength, click Generate again. Repeat this process for each visual you need in motion. Each motion clip will last about 4 seconds, so plan to generate multiple clips for a smooth, engaging final video. When each animated visual is ready, open the video preview and download it. Repeat the entire process for each scene in your script. This way, you'll quickly build a full video with short, animated clips perfect for an engaging high-quality production. Music and sound effects can truly elevate your video from good to outstanding. Think of it this way. Viewers want to feel the content, and the right audio can make a massive difference in retention. To show the impact, just try watching a video without music or effects. Once upon a time, in a small village hidden by towering trees. Now compare that to one with carefully selected sound and music. Once upon a time, in a small village hidden by towering trees, there lived a young boy named Hero. The difference is powerful, right? Be mindful of copyright when choosing music for YouTube. Using copyrighted music without permission can lead to your video being flagged or even taken down. Instead of browsing for random tracks on YouTube, go with trusted, copyright-free platforms like Pixabay. It offers a vast collection of free, royalty-free music that you can use at no cost. You will be noticed I started with the soothing sound of birds chirping to set a natural tone, followed by gentle water waves to maintain a peaceful flow. These sounds not only enhance the visual experience, but also keep viewers engaged, drawing them into the ambience you're creating. 
Here's how to find these sounds. Head to Pixabay and search for Calm Music. Click this button and choose Music. Now you will find a copyright free music. Take some times and choose the best. Similarly, for sound effect, search for the sound you need and choose Sound Effects. You will get the stunning sound effects for your video. Another great resource for music is Chosik.com, where you can find high quality copyright free music tracks. Download your chosen music and sound effects, then layer them into your video. This will Will help keep viewers engaged and make your content much more memorable. For this type of video, simple editing is more than enough. You don't need fancy high-end software for editing. Im going with CapCut will work perfectly, and it's free. Head over to CapCut and click on Create New Project. Click on Import and bring all your audio files into the project. Place each voice clip on the timeline following the sequence of your script. Now, it's time to add our visuals. Import the motion video you've created and align them with the voiceover. Make sure to adjust the duration of each visual to sync with the audio. It helps tell the story smoothly. To make transitions between scenes look natural, add simple transitions. Just click Transition and select one that suits the video's mood. This keeps the flow engaging. Now, let's add some effects to enhance the overall vibe. Go to the Effects tab and look for a subtle filter like By the Fireplace under the Spark category. This adds warmth and atmosphere, especially for cozy, inspiring content. Apply it to the entire video for a consistent look. Moving on to background music, import a music track and add it to the timeline. To make it feel smooth, increase the fade in and fade out times for a natural start and finish. As I said, sound effects are a great touch. Import sound effects you downloaded and place them at specific moments for added depth and immersion. Next, captions. Click on captions and use the auto caption feature to generate text for the video. Go to text tab and customize it by choosing the best font and style. Choose a font that's easy to read and aligns with your video's mood. Now go to animation and click on caption tab and choose the best one for an extra touch of movement and professionalism. Finally, once you're happy with everything, it's time to export. Click export to save your video and that's it. You've just created a beautiful video with CapCut, ready to share with your audience. To boost your video's visibility, let's get started with VidIQ, a powerful tool for optimizing YouTube content. First, search for VidIQ Chrome extension and click on the first link. Click Install Chrome extension, then Add to Chrome. After installation, you'll be directed to the sign-in page. Sign in with your Google account and connect your YouTube channel to VidIQ. Click Select All, then click Continue. That's it, your channel is now connected to VidIQ. Once that's done, open your browser and you'll see a new VidIQ sidebar. Click Upload and upload your video. Now, it's time to add video details. Let's head over to ChatGPT. Ask it to generate five title suggestions for the video. Pick the one you like best, then request a fully optimized video description for that title. Copy the title and description and paste them back into your video's details on YouTube. For the thumbnail, we'll use AI-generated visuals. Ask ChatGPT to create an image prompt that fits the theme of your video, then paste that prompt into Leonardo AI to generate your image. Once you have the image, open Canva, click Create Design, and choose YouTube Thumbnail. Upload the image you created, right-click, and select Set Image as Background. Add a heading for the video title, choose a clear font, and adjust the colors to match your image. Then, add any effects to make the text pop. Once everything looks perfect, click Share and download your thumbnail. Go back to your video details on YouTube and upload your thumbnail. Next, scroll down to the Tags section. Go to a competitor's video on YouTube, view the vidIQ analysis, and scroll down to Find Proven Tags. Copy these tags, return to your video, and paste them into your tag section. Remember to replace any competitor channel names with your own. Once all is set, click Upload, and your video is live. Once upon a time, in a small village hidden by towering trees, there lived a young boy named Hero. Though his heart was pure, Hero often struggled with patience, always seeking answers quickly and becoming frustrated 
when things didn't go his way. But one day, a wise elder in the village, an old monk named Kaito, invited Hiro to join him for a journey into the forest. Do you see this stream, Hiro? Watch it closely, let it teach you. But it's just water, moving slowly. What could it possibly teach me? As the minutes passed, Hiro grew restless. To him, the stream seemed to be doing nothing remarkable, just flowing, quietly, patiently. His fingers tapped the ground as his thoughts raced. Hero, have you noticed how this stream moves around the rocks without force, without resistance? No matter what stands in its way, it flows gently, finding a path around any obstacle. It may be slow, but it always reaches its destination. The stream does not push or rush. It knows that in time it will carve its way through the toughest stones, not by force, but by patience and persistence. Life is much the same, hero. Obstacles will come, but they are not there to stop us. They teach us to be like this water, to move patiently, steadily and calmly, no matter what stands in our way. A deep calm washed over Hiro as he watched the water glide effortlessly around each rock. He began to understand the strength of water was not in its speed, but in its gentle persistence, its quiet resilience. From that day on, whenever Hiro faced challenges or felt overwhelmed, he would close his eyes and picture the stream, steady, unwavering, and gentle. He learned to approach his own life in the same way, discovering that true strength lies in patience, in resilience, and in trusting the journey, even when the path is unclear. And so, Hero's heart became like the stream, unbreakable, not from force, but from the quiet strength of persistence and patience. We too can be like the water finding our way around life's obstacles, not through force, but with gentle resilience. Remember, no matter what stands in your way, with patience and inner strength, you will carve a path forward. Congratulations on making it this far. You're officially stepping into the YouTube business. Now, with Channel Live, let's commit to posting videos consistently for the next 30 days. I'll be sharing live updates and results along the way, so stay tuned. You'll find all the links and prompts used in this process in the description below. If this channel has been helpful to you, please like the video and share your thoughts in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe to both our channels to stay updated on future tips and insights.